Hello friends, if you're part of the family, welcome back. If you're new here, thank you so much for stopping by. Today's video um, is for my girls out there. It is Friday, happy Friday. And I wanted to go through, I haven't done this in a while, but I wanted to go through a few of my Ipsy products that I get, that I got this month, month of March. Um, and again, this is a service that I pay, it's a beauty subscription that I pay $25 a month and I get uh, five full-size products. And if you're into makeup and skincare the way that I am, and I am using and trying, trying to try things, trying to try new things, um, there's a good, uh, good subscription for you to check out. So I'm looking up here the items because I want to be able to tell you guys the price of each one. And if I'm able to try it on. I will, I don't have a lot of makeup on my face right now, um, but I am willing to give it a go. Okay, so here we go. Um, here is the bag that it came in, okay? And uh, I will let you know, uh, hopefully the price per item and then how much this bag is worth, okay? Again, I only paid 25 bucks. So first thing that I'm gonna go through is a blush by um, the brand called Ofra, Ofra Cosmetics. And this is the Pressed Blush in Bellini. Bellini. This is what it looks like over here. I'm gonna do it zooming in, okay. Um, and this is a full-size product and full-size product and it is, uh, it retails for $29, okay? So I love blushes. And I have a highlighter from Ofra that I like um, called Rodeo Drive. But this is what it looks like, this is the package. I'm gonna open it up. Ooh, that's pretty. So this is kind of like a peachy, peachy blush. And it comes with a mirror and I need a blush brush. Give me one second. Okay, so here is a blush brush that I'm going to try. Let me zoom in a bit. There we go. And I'm gonna try it on my cheeks. I think I have a small amount of blush that I put on earlier. But I wanna see how this one looks. So let me dive in here. I'm on. Oh, that's really pretty. Very nice. Let me zoom in some more. So that is what that looks like. The light is changing here in my in my uh, in my room. I film my room and I have a ring light here, but I'm right in front of the sun, so it changes, it shifts. There we go. So that is what that looks like. It's really, really pretty, very natural. I like. All right, so continuing on, that was the blush. And that one, like I said, is worth $29. The next item right here, it is, ooh, a liquid glow um, highlighter. So let's look for that one. Right over here, and this is by Anastasia Beverly Hills. Again, it's a liquid glow in Perla. And the price, the retail price for this is $25. And again, this is a full size product. Let's go ahead and open it. I love highlighters, but I'm not a big fan of liquid um, highlighters. I feel like they get messy and like all over my hands and face and but this one's really pretty it's gold let me swatch it and then we're gonna put it on my cheeks Ooh, Ooh that's pretty <gasps> I think I put a lot Hi. yeah I put too much <gasps> that's really nice all right so let me zoom in so I can put some on my cheeks there we go maybe I could I'm gonna take some from what I already have on my and okay blend 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 <laughs> oh my goodness i think i put too much so maybe for this you can use a um how do you say it a sponge wow so that did not really blend so easily Put some on my nose. Maybe I just have to play with it a little more. And then on the other side. I 
This is why I don't like liquid highlighters. This is why, because they don't blend out. <sighs> Maybe I'm doing it wrong. Maybe I'm doing it with my fingers and I should be doing it with, how do you say it, a, a, a sponge, but it just looks, it's like it's just sitting there. It doesn't really sink into the skin. Maybe I need to play with it a little more, but anyways, that's what that looks like. Let's continue on. All right, so next we have a red lipstick and it is by Haas or House Laboratories. Um, it is a sparkle lipstick in burlesque. And this one, uh, it is obviously a full size product and it cost $20. So let me go ahead and put on some red lipstick right now. Um, it is Wednesday afternoon at almost 5 p.m. <laughs> Let's do it. All right, this is what it looks like. Oh, the packaging is really pretty. Kind of has that ombre silver black look to it. You see? Ooh, that's really pretty. It has like glitter strips going down the lipstick. I don't know if you can see it. You see it? It has like glittery strips. All right. Let's swatch it and then we're gonna put it on, apply it on our lips. So it is not a matte lipstick. It is a glittery shimmer lipstick. You see? All right, here we go. Oh wow, that is beautiful. Woo! So that is what this looks like. Very nice. I love it. All right, let's continue on. Let me go ahead and clear that. Oh, I just like brushed it off or like wiped it off and I see there's gold glitter and shimmer on the lipstick. I don't know if you can see it. You see it right there? That's gold. So there's gold in this lipstick, nice. Okay, next item uh, is a moisturizer. So I'm not gonna apply it on my face because I have lipstick on, but I will try it tomorrow. And it is the Air Repair Skincare Complex Boosting Moisturizer. And this one has a value of $23, okay? So it's 59 fluid ounces, which, well, 59 milliliters, two fluid ounces, and Let's smell it and let's see the consistency that it has. I love moisturizers. I use moisturizers every single day. So every time I get a chance to get a, a new moisturizer or try a new moisturizer in my subscription, um, I'm all about it. So let's put a little bit here in my hand, just a little tap and spread it out. Ooh, it's very creamy, it's light. Um, it does have a scent, but it's not strong, like a floral scent. And yeah, it is a little greasy. It's not drying matte. So it is moisturizing, which is good for a moisturizer, I guess. <laughs> um, just a little, it's a little bit on the greasy side, I would say, but uh, it is very refreshing on the skin. So I can't wait to try this at night. I usually wear very moisturizing uh, moisturizers before I go to bed and I try to do more not so moisturizing, um, not matte, but just like not so uh, moisturizing where it makes my face look greasy. I use those uh, during the day with SPF, okay? So again, that was $23. And the last um, product on here is, ooh, a body lotion. So this is called the Sila Creme de la Creme. Um, and the retail price for this is 30 bucks. It is a full size product and it is a body moisturizer. All right. So this I can apply to my body, hands, arms, legs, chest, everywhere. <laughs> so again, this is creme de la creme. The packaging is really pretty. That's what it looks like. 
and let's try it. We're gonna try it on the other hand, okay? Ooh, it's a body cream, almost like a butter because it's pretty thick. Let's rub it in. It feels very similar to the moisturizer. It's not as greasy. <sighs> What's that smell? I feel like it smells like a cucumber. But it's very moisturizing, it's light, it's not thick and it dries pretty satiny, so it's not very moisturizing. I mean, it's not very greasy is what I meant. I like it. All right, so the overall price or retail value for this bag was $127. And again, I only paid 25 bucks. Okay, all right guys, so that's about it. I'm really loving this lipstick. I'm looking at myself in the little pop out, pop out screen in my camera. It's very pretty, I like it. I think we're gonna go to the park with the kids. So I wanna go to the park looking like this with a red lipstick. It's all good. All right, guys, that's about it. Stay tuned for a few messages from myself. Love you all, and I will see you on my next video. Bye. Hey, friends. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch my videos. It really does mean the world to me that you take time out of your busy schedule to check me out. So thank you so much. I have a few messages to share with you guys. They won't take long at all, I promise. So number one, I accept prayer requests. Um, there's a list that we have here uh, at my house that me and my family pray for every single day. So if you have a prayer request um, and you want us to add you to the list, just go ahead and contact me. Uh, you can leave a comment below or you can email me or contact me through any of my social media platforms and we will go ahead and add you to that list. Number two, if you are on Instagram or Facebook, you should totally be following me. Why? Because I post a lot more content there than I do here. I share with you guys just my everyday life, pictures of my kids, recipes, what I do um, on the Insta stories and all that good stuff. So if you are there, go ahead and follow me. And number three, if you are not already part of this family, go ahead and subscribe um, to my channel and hit that notification bell so that every time I upload a new video, you get notified. We have so much fun here. I post videos on my life. I do vlogs. I do makeup reviews. I do recipes. And also I do Bible studies. So if you're interested, go ahead and join our family. We would love to have you. Mm. All right, guys, so that's about it. That was nice, short, and sweet for you guys. Thank you again for watching. Um, don't forget our hope in life and death is in Christ Jesus. Love you all, and I will see you on my next video, Lord willing. Bye.